hey beauties welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome in today's video we are going to be doing a review of the new lisa eldridge spring summer collection yes i finally did get my second order and it has arrived and i cannot wait to show you guys what i picked up so if you want to see what i picked up from lisa eldridge keep on watching okay beauties look at this my goodies have finally arrived and I cannot wait to show you guys what I purchased. I am actually someone that is new to Lisa Eldridge. I actually don't own nothing, not even a single thing from her brand, but I have heard such good things and I have high hopes for this and I'm hoping that I do like it. We are going to get started with this collection. So I actually placed two orders on the Lisa Eldridge website because I first just picked up one lip gloss and I picked up one lipstick and then I started seeing swatches of the other lipsticks and the other lip glosses and then I started to get FOMO. I was like no, I gotta get my hands on some more stuff. I did get my hands on some more stuff. To jump straight into the lipsticks and this is the packaging this is simply how it comes so i am going to leave price descriptions and everything on this side because i just want to get into the lipstick i need to know what is so great about this the first shade i picked up this is in the shade rose official so the longevity of this is 18 month luxurious lucent lip color lipstick that is the packaging oh guys this is my first lisa eldridge lipstick i don't know what to think like I'm so excited. So this is how it comes. And then once you open it, that is how much product you get. So it is pretty deep, the color. Give you guys a swatch. So that is the shade Rose Official. I'm literally just gonna put this straight on. So when you look, it does have the Lisa Eldridge embedded in it. I can't smell anything. It seems to smell like a normal lipstick. So let's get started. I know my video is up late because I placed two orders and my second order only came yesterday. And I was like, I'm not gonna show you guys part of my order or some of my order. I might as well just wait until literally all of my packages arrive. Okay, so this color is quite nice. It's definitely more of a sheer lipstick to me. I definitely do like this color. This color is nice. Mm. They feel really soft, really velvet and soft. I really like this. Okay, so that is the first shade. Also, the lipsticks are magnetic. Let's get this one off and get the next one on. And the next shade we're gonna try is Spirited Away. The lipsticks are made in Italy and it lasts for 18 months. So let me know guys, are you like a fan of Lisa Eldridge or like, do you own a lot of her lipsticks? Cause I'm new to her and so far I'm loving the brand. That is how much product you get. And it also does have her initial there embodied in. So this is definitely just a bit more lighter than Rose Official. And I'm literally just gonna put this straight on as well. This is a nice lipstick, I like this color. This is kind of like a just bitten look. I like this one, this one has to be my favorite. And again, magnetic, yeah. I like this one, this one's nice. Really shiny, it definitely does feel creamy, it doesn't feel dry. It has a really nice sheen effect. Okay guys, so I also picked up 
two lip glosses and I picked up the shade Charm and I picked up the shade Songbird. And the first shade I'm gonna try out, this is in the shade Charm. So this is the packaging. The packaging is all literally the same. The longevity of this is 36 months. So this is the gloss embrace. I'm not gonna lie. I was super excited to try out her lip glosses because I don't know if you're like me, but in the summertime, more or less, I wear lip liner, lipstick, then I top it off with a lip gloss. So I definitely was excited with the lip gloss. So that is the applicator. It is slightly slanted. Are you guys excited for Fenty's new drop tomorrow of her heat lip gloss? Yes, I will be getting my hands on it and I cannot wait to try it because you guys know I am a Fenty gloss girl. I literally have all of her glosses. And yes, I'm gonna be picking up the new one. So if you do wanna see a review of the new Fenty heat lip gloss, do make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out. You know what this is reminding me of? This is reminding me of my Tom Ford lip gloss I have. Absolutely love this lip gloss. You know what this lip gloss is reminding me of? It's literally reminding me of my Tom Ford lip gloss because it is coming up more blue toned on my skin tone. Just to make you guys be aware, I'm sure if you are maybe on the fairer side, it may come up warmer. But for me on my skin tone it's coming up more blue toned i'm just going to show you guys my tom ford lip gloss i was actually wearing this today i don't think they're going to be exactly the same but i think they're going to be close yeah they're definitely really close but the lisa eldridge is just a just a little bit warmer but you can see it's along the lines of that blue toned well, it's showing up on my lips more blue tone. This is a nice lip gloss. I would definitely wear a lipstick and then top it off with a gloss. This is nice. I like this. It doesn't even feel sticky. It doesn't leave that horrible line in the inside when you have on a lip gloss. So, top marks. So far, so good. I really like this. I am happy with what I've purchased so far. Okay, guys. So, the final shade we're going to be trying out. This is in the shade Songbird that I've got. So it's a really nice nude. It looks like it's gonna be a nice peachy, yep. A nice peachy nude. This is nice. I was in the hunt for a lip gloss like this as well. So that is the shade. Songbird. Just there. Okay, so I'm gonna take this one off. I'm gonna try the next one on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on a lipstick quickly. That is all of the lipstick and lip glosses that I picked up. Now, I was actually looking at the blushes and I was going to get one, but I personally don't like liquid blushes. So I did simply make a pass on the liquid blushes, but I did pick up a highlighter. I'm going to leave everything in the description just beside, just so you guys know about everything that comes with it because she came up with about I think three highlighters and I decided to get the deeper shade and this is in the shade Celestial Fire. This is the Elevated Glow by Lisa Eldridge Seamless Skin. Longevity of this is 12 months and this is made in Italy. So this is the packaging. This is how it comes. All the ingredients is at the back. I definitely am excited about trying out her liquid highlighter as you guys can see my face is done we are missing some highlighter I, I also don't have on a bronzer because i am actually going to be reviewing the new vive by genevieve modern bronzer and i do have it here just beside me and that video will be going up tomorrow because this video is live and it's wednesday so the bronzer video will be going up tomorrow by genevieve so let's try out this highlighter and see how it looks because i need to glow this is the applicator and I'm literally just gonna put it on the high point. 
bits of my cheek just there i'm gonna be very careful with a liquid highlighter guys you literally have to be so careful to make sure you don't like you know over highlight so i'm just gonna get a beauty blender okay. so i'm just oh might have put on too much there okay so i'm just gonna blend it out give you guys a swatch so that is how the highlighter looks as well and that is how it's looking on me okay beauties so my final thoughts on the new lisa eldridge collection i absolutely love this as for a first impression as someone who is just new to lisa eldridge and as someone that doesn't own any of lisa eldridge's anything from her i absolutely love this collection i am definitely happy with my purchases i'm mostly happy that i did go back and get the second order because i didn't want to miss out and i didn't feel like i was you know not getting what i really wanted and i also got this free pouch i decided to get the red velvet one because this one just grabbed my attention the most you can get this color you can get green and you can get blue the lipsticks went on absolutely perfectly seamless i love this lipstick has to be my favorite one it was so soft it's literally like velvet the lip glosses are perfect they don't leave that horrible rim on the inside of your lips and they just feel so comfortable and i think to come up with some new lip glosses in the summertime this is when mostly everybody is wearing lip glosses so i'm definitely glad that she did do that so do let me know if you're gonna be purchasing anything from the new lisa eldridge collection and i'll see you guys in my next video do make sure you like comment subscribe bye